Hey everyone, I'm Chase at Rocky Mountain ATVMC, and this is our 2019 Premium Off-Road Helmet Buyer's Guide. All right, so in this video today, we wanna to show you six of some of our top picks in our best-selling premium off-road motocross helmets. There's a lot of great options that are out there, so it can be difficult choosing which one's gonna be best for you. But the good news is, is that they're all really good options. And honestly, I don't think you go wrong with any one of the six helmets that we're gonna show you today. I think motorcycle helmet companies over the last few years have been big, making big leaps when it comes to helmet technology and making them safer for riders. So if that's what you're in the market for, this video should give you a really good starting point. So what I'm gonna do is just go through, briefly cover some of the key features and the highlights that each one of these helmets has and what makes them unique. And when you find one that you're interested in, you wanna learn more about it, watch the product spotlight where I break them down in the full detail. We talked about the outside, we cover the inside, give you all the information that you're gonna to wanna to know about these helmets to help you make that decision. So now with all that out of the way, let's get started. All right, so the first helmet in our lineup is the Supertech M10 coming from Alpine Stars. Alpine Stars debuted this helmet in 2018. It's their first go at a premium helmet, and I think they did a fantastic job. Very comfortable helmet. It fits true to size. Now remember, helmets are an apparel item, and this goes for all the helmets that we sell at Rocky Mountain. If you get any one of these and you're not happy with the sizing or the fitment, we call it our fit guarantee, send it back to us in brand new unused condition. We give you free shipping both ways on your first exchange because we want to make sure that you get the right size and the right fitment that you are looking for. But with the M10, again, very comfortable helmet, size large, three pounds on the dot. So this is just one of two helmets in our lineup that comes in at three pounds or less. So if you're looking for a lightweight helmet, this will not disappoint. It can be DOT, ECE certified. You're gonna get a carbon fiber composite shell. That's what's keeping it so lightweight. But what is unique, and one thing I love that Alpine Stars did with this helmet, they did a lot of research, a lot of development, that even the shape of the shell has a very unique shell shape, in my opinion, is designed to help absorb and disperse as much impact as possible. You're gonna have a breakaway visor that's gonna break away regardless of the angle, as long as enough force is applied. Big safety feature there. But internally, there's a lot of great features. You're gonna have a four-piece EPS liner. So there's four separate pieces inside this shell, and they're different densities. And they put those different densities in the areas that are gonna help protect the head the most. Also, what I like too, a MIPS liner system built in, stands for multi-directional impact protection system. So the MIPS liner is a feature that we see in a lot of premium helmets, but what is unique to Alpine Stars is that they actually have an exclusive MIPS liner system that's two pieces instead of one, which is gonna help get a little bit more airflow throughout the helmet with that MIPS liner. You're also gonna be eject helmet ready, so if you want to run the helmet eject removal system, it does come ready for that. It doesn't come included, but you can't pick that up on our website. And the last feature that I like about this is Alpine Stars, they thought about all riding dis disciplines, not just motocross and off-road riders. They actually have pockets cut out into the liner on the inside if you want to run a Bluetooth communication headset. So if that's something you like to use, so maybe you're doing some adventure riding, some dual sport, you wanna run that Bluetooth comms device, they allow you to run those speakers inside this helmet. But that is the Supertech M10 coming from Alpine Stars. All right, next up, we've got the V3 with MIPS and MVRS coming from Fox Racing. If you're a rider that likes to match his gear sets with his helmet, well, Fox is gonna be a really good brand to choose because they always have really good riding gear and they always have colorways in their helmets to match those. Now with this, size large comes in at 3.2 pounds, so very lightweight helmet. Now keep in mind with fitment with the V3, we feel it runs just a little bit small. So if you're right between sizes, we would recommend going up one size with the helmet. But the liner on the inside, in my opinion, very, very comfortable. Now the way they keep the helmet lightweight and also very strong, they have their multi-composite shell technology. So they have four different shell sizes with four different EPS liners, which I like. On the inside, you can have dual density EPS liner. MIPS liner system comes with the helmet. I just talked about that a second ago. What I like about the MIPS liner, again, it's that slip zone between the rider's head and the shell to help mitigate those rotational forces. And another really cool feature that Fox is using in their V3 with MIPS and the MVRS, that MVRS stands for Magnetic Visor Release System. And what they've designed the visor on the V3 to do is break away like we saw with some of the other helmets in the lineup. So when enough force is applied, it's not gonna add any additional forces to the rider's head or to the neck. So the visor will break off. And the way they do that is with actually with a magnetic system, which I think is cool. That way, if you do have a crash, the visor pops off because it is magnets. You can take the visor and actually just pop it back on. So it's a really cool system. Again, a lot of cool safety features built in. Really cool colorways, again, to match the gear. That is a V3 with MIPS and MVRS from Fox Racing. All right, so next up, we've got the Moto9 Carbon Flex coming from Bell. Now, Bell helmets, 
They've been making helmets since the 1950s, so it's easy to say that these guys definitely know what they're doing. They know how to make a premium helmet. Some really cool features built in. Size large, comes in at three and a half pounds. You can be DOT and Snell certified. Now this is one of three helmets in the lineup that is Snell certified. If you're not familiar with that, well Snell is a nonprofit organization known for having some of the most rigorous standards when it comes to helmet safety, and it's not cheap to get your helmet Snell certified. The helmet manufacturer like Bell has to send their helmet off to them and ask that they run their helmet through their test to make sure that it meets their standards, and that's what a lot of riders look for in helmet is that Snell certification. But with this, you got to have a carbon fiber composite shell. It keeps it lightweight, keeps it strong. I like the look, the aggressive look of the Moto 9 Carbon Flex. There's a lot of cool features on the inside that I really like. I love their cheek pads, magnetic cheek pads called MERS. Very easy to take in and out. It's just a convenience thing that I'm a big fan of. But what's unique about Bell, the only company doing this, they have a three layer liner impact protection system. So on the inside of the helmet, you have three separate liners. And the reason for those is they're different densities and they help absorb impacts at your low, your medium, and your high speed. You can still have a bad brain injury or head injury at a lower impact or a lower speed. And that's why I have those, they have those three different densities to help absorb those at different speeds. The other feature I like is they have their slip zone, which means it's kind of like the MIPS liner system. In other words, it's just going to help that liner slip just a little bit to help mitigate those rotational forces. And just like we saw with some of the other helmets, this is going to be eject helmet removal ready. So it does not come included, but again, you can pick that up on our website. But that's the Moto 9 Carbon Flex from Bell. All right, so next up, making its way into our premium helmet guide for the first time, this is the VFX Evo coming from Shoei. Now, Shoei is a Japanese company, and like Bell helmets we just saw, they've been making quality helmets since the 1950s. We saw the VFX W, which was their premium helmet for a lot of years, but they updated the styling of the shell as well as the visor for the VFX Evo, and now a big new safety feature is their meds liner system. We'll talk more about that here in just a minute. But it's going to fit true to size, very comfortable helmet, your DOT and Snell certified like we just saw with the Bell. Now my only nitpick with the VFX Evo is that a size large comes in at 3.7 pounds. So it is the heaviest helmet that we have in our lineup. So for me, 3.7 pounds, just a little bit heavy for a premium helmet. But there's some cool safety features built in. You're going to get their AIM Plus technology when it comes to their shell. So it's a six ply matrix shell, which they say keeps the helmet rigid, but also does a very good job of absorbing impact. And the other big feature that I like so much about it is that MEDS liner system. And what it is, is a separate insert inside the helmet at the top of the rider's head, which is strategically connected to the helmet by four columns. And the purpose for that is to allow it to absorb both impacts, but also because it can move freely inside the helmet, it helps mitigate those rotational forces. So again, that's Shoei's take on helping mitigate those rotational forces in those impacts. I think it's a really cool system. Also, I just have to say, with the VFX Evo, one of my favorite looking helmets that is up here. Very aggressive lines, really cool colorways to choose from. That is the VFX Evo from Shoei. All right, moving on down the line, we've got the SE4 Carbon coming from Troy Lee Designs. Just like with that Alpine Stars helmet, if you're looking for a super light helmet, this will be another one that I would consider. Size large, three pounds exactly, so very lightweight, very comfortable on the head. And what's impressive about that weight and the size large, is this is going to be DOT and Snell certified. Now, typically with Snell certified helmets, they tend to be a little bit heavier because they have to meet those rigorous standards from Snell. So the fact that Troy the Designs kept this at three pounds in a size large and it's Snell certified, to me, that's really impressive. So you've got a carbon fiber Kevlar shell. That's what makes it lightweight and rigid. On the inside, I really like the Comfort Liner. Very comfortable helmet. But some of the other safety features about this helmet I really like. You're going to get the MIPS liner system on the inside, so we've already covered that. Great safety feature built in. But what's unique about the SE4 Carbon is you have a three-piece EPS liner system, and each piece is a different density, and they've strategically put those in the areas to help protect the rider's head the most. And also, Troy Lee Design says that compared to all the other helmets in the market, that they've added 13% more EPS liner up here in the front in the headband area to help with impacts, as well as 8% more in the back of the helmet up at the top, as well as the bottom down here in the back as well. So they've added extra EPS liner to help absorb as much impact as possible. So again, very lightweight helmet, MIPS liner system, you're getting that multi-piece EPS liner included. That's the SE4 Carbon from Troy Lee Designs. All right, so last but not least, we've got the ATR2 coming from 6D. Now, a few years back when 6D came out the ATR1, in my opinion, I think the ATR1 really changed the game in how helmet manufacturers were looking at helmet safety and how they were building their helmets. I'll explain why, but it has to do with their ODS, or omnidirectional suspension technology. But the ATR2, I own one personally, very comfortable helmet. Fitment is true to size. 
Size large comes in at 3.1 pounds, so very lightweight helmet. You're going to be DOT ECE certified. You've got a tri-composite shell. This helmet, in my opinion, does vent very well, but the big standout features that make this helmet so awesome is their ODS technology on the inside. It stands for omnidirectional suspension. So what you have on the inside of the ATR2, you have two separate liners. You have an outer liner connected to the shell. That is EPP, which is expanded polypropylene. And then you have a separate liner, which is EPS, expanded polystyrene. And those two EPS liners are separated by 11 isolation dampeners. And the reason for those dampeners is they compress so they absorb impact, but they also can move in six degrees of motion, hence the name 6D. And by allowing those to move in those six degrees of motion, it helps mitigate and limit those rotational forces. So it was very innovative from 6D when they came out with those isolation dampeners. And on top of that, you've got their low friction discs that between those two liners that act similar to a MIPS liner system where it's allowing those two liner systems to move freely of each other and to mitigate and help reduce those rotational forces. So there's just a lot of cool technology, again, that's built into the ATR2 from 6D. So overall, very cool helmet. Again, very lightweight, very comfortable, and I love that omnidirectional suspension technology that is built in. This is the ATR2 from 6D. All right, so there you have it. Those are our top six premium off-road motocross helmets for 2019. Now, if you found a couple that you're interested in, remember, watch those product spotlight videos where we talk about them in full detail. Now, this was our premium helmet buyer's guide. If you're interested in a feature-rich helmet that's gonna be a little bit more budget-friendly, we do have a top five helmet video under $300, so watch that if you're looking for something that's gonna be a little bit more budget-friendly or in your price range. Remember, all these helmets up here ship for free. To pick yours up, it's real simple. Just click on the link at the end of this video. If you guys have any questions, leave your comments below, give us a call or chat live online and we will get your questions answered. I am Chase, we'll see you on the trails.